Hello and good morning. Welcome back to another day of my vlog, Sunset Annette. Thank you for joining me and the list that I am trying to tackle today. Um, it's just a matter of sorting and organizing and deciding what I want to keep and what's going to yard sale and all that. But it took my beautiful, serene, wonderful porch and I had to do it. I already told you guys why. I wanted to get out of my storage unit, so this was the only way to do it. I've been in the little storage out here reorganizing, and I've had some success. I've cleaned it out quite a bit in here. I'm going to take this shelf down, though, and put it over here and just add it because that'll give me more head space to be able to work. Um, so that is one of the things, and let me turn this little light on. <clears throat> and here is the shelves I put up last night or yesterday and I still have three more of that kind and one more of this kind but I don't have any more brackets to be able to put that one up so I'm not sure where I'm going to use them um, or when but I got my little ladder in here and it tucks away pretty good over there I may move it around some um, let's see, got my camping gear over there, and for right now, some of my gardening supplies are all up in here, but I want to eventually move them to that little wooden cart. I gotta get it painted, and then I can have it out and have all this stuff on it. <clears throat> so that's the goal for that. But just trying to get things done today and more organized so I can be able to take back my porch and my serenity zone because it is in a shambles right now and I'm not liking that very much. Anyway, so I will show you progress as it happens. Bye. <clears throat> Dang, it's not good to stop by yourself sometimes. never a nail put here at the top so I'm going to need to do that I think I'm going to secure it to the wall first yep on either side
Please don't sting my bee. so much easier once I get this side supported. one to support this upper side. Yes. All right. Now it's tight. And level. Can you see it? Do you see it? Bam. Make sure you can see that. Can you see that? Can you see that? Wait. <laughs> the wood is warped. Okay, right there is level. And there it's level. So that's what's that's what's up. Got it done. Yes. So the plan is I have all my little nail and screw containers and stuff up here and it is inconvenient as often as I'm reaching for them. So new home right there. New home. And this is made to where it could be hung right there. But I worry it's a hard plastic and I'm rough. Not too rough, but it could be. All right. Oh my gosh, that's better. And see, now I have this room back here. Oh, that room. That's more headspace. So that is really good. And let's see. I'm really not sure what to do with some of this stuff. But okay. these are some hooks I got the other day in case I needed them for in here.
I have some things I'm just like, I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I can't bring myself to get rid of it. That's like a big plastic tarp. I am sure something's going to happen and I'm going to need a big plastic tarp. May not be today. May not be tomorrow. Can't have too many of these. Ooh, yeah, yeah. I love these things. All right. Zip ties. We could zip tie a house together. <laughs> Let's see. I don't know. I think we still need to be here. I don't buy these things. Somebody gave them to me. I put a couple in the house. The uh, smell that comes from it. I'm not a fan. But for moisture control, it does work. Definitely works. All right, we'll start leaving that way. Actually, I may put a little hook. Oh, no, that won't work because this place is too big. I'll need to... Okay, let's see this. I'll need to move that light around a lot. So for now... Okay, making some headway. I brought a garbage can that has a bunch of curtain rods in it. I think I'm going to put it right there and put that wood in it too and just combine it.
rods that I've got. I think they'll fit there. I can't believe I have so many. But until I got all the windows in, I am not getting rid of anything. So I know exactly what I'm going to use. This is a piece of wood I'm planning to do some kind of artwork or something with. It's just so, so pretty. But I don't want to stand it on this sharp end and take the chance of breaking it. So we're going to go on this side. All right, I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do in 
organizing. I was thinking about putting up all the garden tools, but I've got that little garden trolley thing that I'm going to be using and putting my garden tools there. So, I would like to be able to move this right here. I've got this. Which I wonder if you know it doesn't hang better that way. This is called a lion ball. It's what you buy for zoos, for lions. Can you see how Phoenix has torn this up over the years? That's with his teeth. Chewing this thing. This has been his favorite toy ever. And it's indestructible. But this is what he's done to it. Unfortunately, in this yard, it's not fenced because when he plays with it, he pushes it with his nose. By the time he gets finished playing, sometimes his nose is raw because he's played so hard and because of all the grooves that are in it. I've actually sanded this back to where it was almost smooth again and given it to him again, and he's done this to it. But um, not having a fence here, he would push it. He would he would not even pay attention. He'd be halfway down to county. Um, this is all he becomes focused on. So he, he loses track of where he is. So I have to have a fenced in area to give him this. So I hope one day I can do that because watching him play with it is so cute. It's really cute. All right, this is going in the house. All right, I think that's enough of this organization for now. And uh, if I do some more to it, I'll catch you up.